case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1999, the Court of Appeals of Maryland heard the case of Owens v. State, which centered on the concept of strict liability in criminal law, where knowledge and diligence are not necessary to prove guilt. The case also dealt with whether the law can make irrebuttable assumptions that deny a person their due process rights. Timothy Owens was charged with second-degree rape under Maryland's statutory rape law for engaging in sexual intercourse with a 13-year-old girl named Ariel Coretta Johnson. Owens argued that he believed Johnson was over the age of 13. However, the court deemed this defense inadmissible because the law is considered a strict liability offense. The court then needed to determine if barring a mistake-of-age defense in Maryland's statutory rape law violated due process rights under the 14th Amendment of the U.S. Constitution and Articles 20 and 24 of the Maryland Declaration of Rights. Ultimately, the court ruled that Owens's due process rights were not violated, and he was convicted of second-degree rape. The court held that disallowing a mistake-of-age defense in Maryland's statutory rape law was constitutional, as it served the state's interest in protecting children from sexual abuse. This decision affirmed the lower court's judgment, making Owens responsible for the costs associated with the case. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.